Hey everyone, what is up? The King of Canterbury District here and welcome back to another new video where today we are going to be participating in another shift. I've seen the amount of support you guys have given me on the last part and it feels like I should really consider doing a part three because you guys seem to enjoy these videos quite a lot. So I actually requested this shift on a Saturday and seems like Very Epic is the person to do this on a Monday night. And here's the scenario. There has been a few shortages in Canterbury recently, but a new supply has been brought in, which means a lot of people are trying to get fuel at various petrol stations around Canterbury. Expect queues of cars nearby petrol stations. So this could be one of the first shifts to ever have traffic jams going on. To help out with the fuel shortage, it was decided that if possible, only electric and hybrid buses should be on the road. Only use electric and hybrid buses for the shift. That is exactly what I'm going to be using. Anyways, we're going to wait until the shift to begin and we'll join in and start our shift. This is the first London route PR1, 2, LBAG's YouTube channel. Go subscribe. So it looks like we are now joining the Canterbury shift. Let's get ourselves in, pick a bus and drive a random selected route. Already in the game, it's seven o'clock. Is anyone in? I'm the only one in the server just yet. So it's telling us to go for either a hybrid, electric or hydrogen bus. But I haven't driven the Metro City for quite some time now. So I'm thinking I'm going to give that out for a drive in the city red livery. And let's have a look and see how this disruption is going on then. Yep, everyone is joining now, I can see that. So we are in now, and I need to think about what route goes for the most petrol stations. I had a think about what route I wanted to do um, for the shift earlier, and my option is to go for Route 37, since that goes through three petrol stations along the way. One at East Canterbury, one near the main roundabout, and one near Spring Lane. So we're gonna actually going to start at Canterbury Academy instead of starting at the bus station as we normally start off at. And we're not starting off at the hospital as well because I want to do it a different way. Uh, so we're going to make our way to the hospital now. We're about to pass through a petrol station. I'm just curious, is there any traffic there? Yeah, I can see a few cars there already. I can see that. Oh, yeah, there we go. We can see a few cars in traffic right there we've got to watch out for that on the way back yeah we can already see a few people um seeing me already yep i'm definitely i'm going to do a part three yeah oh cool tell me about it yep i already have an electric bus and that is no other than the metro city on the route 37 i'm going to find my way to the academy now we'll start the route uh, and we will get our way to the hospital and pass through a bunch of petrol stations. We should be making a right turn here, then another right, then we can be able to start our Route 37. So the route goes via Willow Estate, East Canterbury, passing through the first petrol station there. And then we get to the Canterbury Main Roundabout, where they have another petrol station there that we just saw just a moment ago. You can see a few cars already um, waiting to go into the petrol station. And then after that, we go to the bus station, leave, and then we get to Spring Lane petrol station. I haven't seen how much traffic they have there at the moment, but we will be able to see how much traffic they have once we um, get along the way. Uh, so I guess we'll close the doors now and this get ourselves Kansas going City, to Red Canterbury Hospital. So to let's um, Canterbury do the time Hospital lapse. Via Canterbury bus station. <laughs> So we are just passing through East Canterbury right now and the petrol station seems to be up ahead over here. Hopefully we don't have to deal with this many, many traffic. Uh, there's long lines of petrol stations. But is there any here? Yeah, there's one definitely up ahead. You can see a few people using it. Yeah, see a few cars. A few cars on the other side of the door carriageway, so we don't have to worry about traffic on this side. Uh, yeah, I can definitely see a few cars getting in line right there. So hopefully we won't get in touch with the traffic very much. Uh, but we do have to get into some traffic once we get to the main roundabout where we normally get to. So, uh, let's speed this up now. To 
just passing the old Dover roundabout now and we are about to get in touch with the traffic ahead uh, yep I can definitely see that up ahead I have good eyes uh, so actually I'm gonna have to go onto the right lane here yeah? so we can avoid the traffic going into the petrol station right there yeah is that it? That is definitely crazy. You can see the amount of cars in there. That's about to run out and people are going to be struggling to find petrol. And we are not far away from the bus station now, actually. We're about to turn it on. And we are now approaching Canterbury bus station. I can see a few people using the bus station here. I can see a bunch of people. Oh, I can see a familiar person I've known. Zachary. But he's waiting for me though, isn't he? I'll get the doors opening here. And we've got a few people. Are they going to come on? Yep. Zachary's definitely getting on. So good evening to you. Well, we are getting a few people on board today. Which is a nice surprise, really. Even on a shift, uh, normally you get many people driving as what they mostly do. And sometimes you get some people who like to like chill and ride buses. This guy's asking for a day rider. So we'll do the basic role playing as usual gives the ticket to the guy he goes sit down and i drive off pays and take i don't know how much money i've been paid for and i've been greeted so let's go now then we will be making our way to the hospital with three passengers on board is it actually free yeah definitely free then we is that another person about to get on i'm uh, trying to let him on oh, i guess i could while i'm here yeah or yeah. oh, that's one of the ways to break through the doors okay that's one of the way to do it now we have four passengers on board so now let's um, work our way over to um, Canterbury Hospital. I don't know what's going on. Is someone not sitting? Okay, I don't know. This is really should be fixed, really. If someone is standing, then the bus just goes very slow. I really hope they fix this problem in the next version or 4.2. Yeah, thank you very much. Now we can time lapse to the hospital now. turning there but we're just passing through the windsheep from mcdonald's and kentucky fried chicken about to pass through warwick road bus stops here and we're about to approach the nearby hospital petrol station up ahead it's in a few cars parked but hopefully we don't have as many traffic as we normally get yep oh my god yep now that is definitely some traffic right there is it are these cars hittable I'm pretty sure you can drive through them, but I'm not going to do that. I'm going to have to go onto the other lane. Hopefully no one comes through this lane and we should be all good. And there we go. We don't have to deal with much traffic now. And yet there's a lot of cars parked at that petrol station. So, uh, and it seems like we are already near the hospital already. That was a quick trip. That was, that's for sure. And it looks like we are now arriving into Canterbury City Hospital. And we'll stop there, open the doors, and there we have it. We have arrived at the hospital. That was a quick shift, actually. That didn't go on for long. We had Sacri on board, had a few of these guys on. And it feels like we're going to the uh, drive in there already. Is it right to get a picture of the bus? Yeah, absolutely. Actually, I'm going to leave my bus behind now because I have uh, already done my driving thing that I'm supposed to do for the video. Anyways, let's do the next part. Bus spotting. Anyways, here we are now at the nearby petrol station near the Canterbury roundabout. So we're going to spend like 10 minutes here watching the buses and then we get to the end of the shift photo. Hello! So it looks like we got a fan here wanting to take a screenshot of us, sir. Well, let's let him do that and then we'll continue. I Sorted. Thank you so much.
Okay, so we just did our time doing a bit of boss spotting at the main Canterbury roundabout near the central petrol station. And now we are almost at the end of the shift, so it's about time we should be heading over to do the end of the shift photo. Well, rest in peace that message that has been covered by tags, but I think I know why that was there for. And I think it's time to do the screenie if they are going to make a difference saying to it, like, EC petrol station. Well, it turns out I was already there since... Uh, so looks like I'm gonna get myself parked up now and do the screenshot. I'll park here with these um, two MMC buddies. Uh, one in 5400 over there. A Metro City is just, oh wow, that is fantastic parking, mate. Blocking the Voto. And then we've got a Citano East City over there. I find it weird how someone just uses a West Midlands MMC for this year. I'm thinking one of those buses, the um, Platinum ones, are hybrid ones. And if I'm wrong, make sure to correct me down below if it's either a normal diesel or it's a hybrid. Uh, I'm always curious of how you're going to do this screenshot with a lamp post in your way. Uh, don't do a screen like this because it will block my entire face off. Or like that, that, or just over here like that. I'm just going to say, oh my word, are you serious? Uh, why are you pushing my bus back for, man? Right, leave this metro city. I can't get out now because Zachary's right there. Oh, right, there we go. Hopefully, I put my emergency brake on that, so that shouldn't be able to move now. Okay, now I'm actually here. Hopefully, we do not have another problem with this bus pushing himself back uh, by three people standing on top of my bus. That just went rolling back like a bus has a mind of its own. At least... Well, the good thing is now that everyone is finally here and RIP oh, that MMC back there just getting pushed away from the photo. Oh, I think it's about to be taken just a sec because everyone's being quite silent. Yep, yeah, not even a mute. We are already done with the photo. So that looks like we are completed, guys. We have finally completed another shift and that was an enjoyable one, actually. So anyways, guys, we're going to leave part three here for now. I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you all did enjoy it. If you want to see another part of Canterbury Shifts or see more videos like this one, make sure to like comment share and subscribe for more videos and we'll see you a lot in the next one until next time bye guys see ya